Kecel. Pst. Max. Hello everybody and welcome to the first analog, as I'm attempting to call it. Like development log is dev log, animation log, maybe analog, but analog is also a word. Anyway, welcome to the first analog. Before I explain everything and get started, I do have to take the dog for a walk and feed the cat. My nose is so red, it is so cold, so I didn't actually record anything, but anyway, it is time for the dev log and the cat is hungry. That's all. What? That's still hot. So it's been a while since I made a video and I'm excited to make one again. Uh, the last videos that I kind of made that are relevant to this the Duolingo versus Rosetta Stone ones, um, there's the first one and the second one, and then there's the month project in October. Now, my month project of November was to get as far as possible in this short film, uh, this animated short film idea. But I ended up making uh, a donut because I was getting into Blender 2.8. I did the donut tutorial with Blender Guru. And on the 10th night, it was complete. Got the donut here, some little animation keyframes. If you go ahead and render it, And I made um, sort of a Ghost Freak model with a slight animation. A beautiful side perspective sketch. Um, and then here's the alt ref image that is not by me. And then here's the alt image that is by me. It's rotated wrong though. But I couldn't figure some things out. November 14th, <laughs> I am kicking myself. This is kind of a, this is a failed attempt at doing these stripes. It kind of worked, as you can see, it's sort of indented. And the cloth, like the normal map for the cloth gets across fine. But essentially the, the idea that I'm getting at is that the month project of November was a complete bomb. I bombed it. Uh, and then in December I was like, oh, maybe I'll, you know, start drawing and get good at art. But I never planned it, so it never happened. And this year I have a ton of month projects planned. And January's uh, was, is, today's the 17th, um, drawing and getting better at art. Uh, now I was in Africa for about 10 days, so it didn't really happen then. I got a little bit done in the first few days doing Pokemon Art Academy and Draw Box lessons. But that being said, I wanted to take the November project and make it the whole year. Granted, I'm still probably not gonna finish the short film by the end of the year, but I've sat down and the past two or so days, I've been really planning in depth. And I was watching one of those devlogs. Uh, I actually have my own attempt at a devlog, but that game has not had any progress made on it since then. I wanted to make an animation log of sorts, and no, no, an analog is the only thing that came to mind. If you have better names, let me know. So yeah, I'll go do the draw box lessons for the day, uh, or the homework, I should say. Bars. And then, uh, yeah, I'll see you in like four seconds, I guess. All right, and now that my camera battery is a little more recharged, uh, I did ellipses. This is the draw box lesson that I was doing. I'll put a link to Dropbox in the description below. In terms of my January project, if anyone's curious, the idea was originally one Pokemon Art Academy thing a day, a Udemy lecture a day, I watched them on 2x speed, and then a draw box, part of a homework, or something like that each day. But I A, think I gave myself too much to work with, and B, I'm unconsciously like, it's not a conscious fear, but I'm really scared of doing art, because the more I try, then I'll realize I'm actually bad at art, and it, it's just that kind of fear that you know threatens your identity. Anyway, I just want to give everyone some context on what's been done for the short film thing. You know, maybe these, maybe these videos could be weekly, but I highly doubt it, especially as the semester starts. Yeah, I'm not gonna give away anything uh, regarding the story, the plot line. A friend of mine, Jack in high school, my best friend, wrote the script for this. I think we were talking about it briefly. I was doing an... This person's car alarm, that's like the fifth time it has gone off in the past 24 hours. We were senior year, I did an independent study in animation um, where I didn't actually get much done, but I did you know, get to focus in animation, uh, 3D modeling and stuff. They wrote the script and I was like, oh, I'm gonna make my final project a short film. So we got the script. I'm not gonna show that off. I wanna keep the story pretty under wraps. I ended up doing some 
I guess, top-down sketches of what the room might look like, and this was about two and a half years ago. Obviously, there's no effort in here. Same fear now, I'm scared that the more I try, you know, the more I realize, the more I realize how bad I am. I was looking out this this morning and I had more done than I thought I did. And then there is this sketchbook that I got a little while ago. I believe it was a gift. There's like spaces for all the parts of the pipeline on like the creation phase or idea phase of your short film. Uh, and I have some sketches done, I believe. Uh, I guess not. <laughs> Uh, but the storyboard, that was one of the things I got done during senior year. Obviously, stick figure is pretty bad. But the first thing for this first analog, God, I hate that name. If you have anything better, again, please tell me. Planning everything out. So one of the biggest problems that I think I had, uh, and this is something that worked really well for my October project, and is probably the reason why I didn't really succeed with my November project, nor did I f like fully succeed with this January project so far. I only have 13 days left for this January project, is planning for the website project I had a bunch of written out notes I have started to get mock-ups done it was it was a fully fledged thing I have yet to put that website live uh, I'm probably gonna redo some of the CSS but that's aside the point for seashell I really didn't have much I said okay I'm gonna learn blender for the first two or so weeks and then I'm gonna have three mini projects I only got one of those mini projects done and then I had a mini collaboration project that I want to do with a friend and we're still kind of working on it it's just really slow and I hope to still get that like mini project done whilst uh, doing the storyboarding and stuff for seashell to you know freshen up my animation skills my modeling skills see if I can get them as fast as I can by the uh, by the time I end up getting to animation okay so I'm gonna do this in a little format I've never done before because I want me to still be in this video this is a uh, uh, like a productivity platform called Airtable I used it three or so years ago for something and I ended up not liking it. But I found that it's really nice for like a roadmap for this project. But yeah, so this is what I have so far. I'm gonna do some work, uh, you know, to end this video with the time lapse on just working on Airtable, filling some more stuff out. Because again, the, the vision for this short film, like it took me a little while. I have these little notes here. Um, about the categories that I wanted to break things into and then I kind of group things up. Yeah, so that's enough talking. This is the planning phase. I'm gonna hopefully finish this air table and then we're gonna end off the video. All right, that's enough of me talking about productivity tools, but that's where I'm at. Every great thing starts with a good plan. Table is the basics of it are done, which is exciting. I'm not gonna do b-roll because <laughs> I've done a lot so far, but we have all the predecessor tasks set up. Pretty much the first step is concept art. I think I'd love to get storyboarding done. I think I'm not gonna do much else for January. I'm just gonna work on my art, hopefully, and just let seashell fester in my brain some more. I mean, the art can be bad, sure, but I do need a good art when I do start bringing everything into Blender. Um, so that is it for this analog. <laughs> I need to, I need a better name so bad. Thanks for watching. Everything great begins with a plan. I don't know how often these videos are going to be, but I do plan on keeping them consistent because I really want this short film thing to happen. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and do my Russian lessons and then go shop for a temporary desk because, um, 